In Osborne v. Ohio, the Supreme Court grappled with the always contentious First Amendment implications of regulating pornography. Creating and distributing child pornography was already illegal, but Ohio's legislature decided it needed to do more. Accordingly, it passed a law prohibiting the possession of material depicting a minor other than the possessor's child or ward in a state of nudity. It made exceptions for material used for bona fide artistic, medical, or educational purposes to which the parents or guardians of the depicted minor consented in writing. The police heard that Clyde Osborne had child pornography. They got a warrant and searched his house. In a desk drawer in Osborne's bedroom, they found a photo album Osborne had assembled for his own personal use. This album contained four photographs depicting nude adolescent males in sexually explicit positions. Osborne was convicted of violating the state statute and sentenced to six months in prison. Osborne appealed, arguing that the First Amendment prohibits states from prohibiting the private possession of child pornography and that the Ohio statute was unconstitutionally overbroad. The Court of Appeals and the Ohio Supreme Court both affirmed his conviction. The United States Supreme Court granted cert.